base stations installed, we've put motion detectors and be close buttons in the right spots in the house. And it's with these door or window sensors that you can really take your be close system up a notch. Of course, you put them on perimeter doors, but you can also place them on cabinets and even the refrigerator. So if you have concerns about your loved one eating on a timely basis and taking medications on a timely basis, these sensors will tell you everything you need to know. You install it with double-sided tape. The battery in here lasts about three years. When the battery is low, caregivers can get a message via email saying, uh, replace the battery. You can wrap rules around these sensors, like what I do at my mom's house. I don't care that the front door is open many times during the day, but if it's ever open after 10 p.m. or before 5 a.m., that's atypical, I wanna know. I get an email, my brother gets a cell phone text message. The be close door or window sensor can actually be put on anything that opens and closes. So if you're worried about your loved one eating or taking their medications, you could pick a cabinet as I have here and install the sensor. It's essential to line up these two arrows. You put double-sided tape on the back of each of these sensors. There's also a backing plate for the bigger one if you need to get some distance and it affixes just like this. Now every time this cabinet is open, the information is sent to your web dashboard. If you have a rule written around this cabinet, you can get a notification in real time that the cabinet was open.